individual. We promote teamwork and we listen. And our vision, which are the things that we want to be acknowledged as, are the brands, to be the brands of choice. We've got multiple brands that we, that we have. To be the employer of choice and also to be the business partner of choice. Those are the things that are going to allow us to, to, to provide the most valued productivity solutions in the world. And Snap-on is a global company. We think globally. We are global. Um, thinking about it, actually, I don't know if that, if that, if that world fits. Because if you think about it, there's a space station floating around the Earth right now. And on it are a lot of Snap-on tools. There's a space shuttle that goes up every now and then to that thing, and on it are a lot of snap-on tools. There's even a, a uh, moon buggy up there somewhere that probably needed tool control because in the toolbox somewhere they left a bunch of snap-on tools on the moon. <laughs> so we really should probably start th be thinking intergalactic. I wonder if uh, my boss will allow me to change my uh, title to intergalactic sales manager. What do you think? <laughs> Anyway, let's ground ourselves here. Um, we first entered the, the international arena in at about 1931. It was a time of the Depression. And we had to do it because we needed to go out and find some other business outside the country, somewhere that was still thriving a little bit, to expand ourselves, to keep our plants running, to keep our people employed so they could put food on the table. Because of that, today our products and services can be found in over 150 countries around the world. And we reach technicians that work on vehicles and trucks um, around the world. We, we, we reach those technicians who service at least 40% of the vehicles that are out there right now. And this coverage will grow as we uh, increase our share of market around the country and also as we expand into some of the areas that we aren't covering today. And in the, in the developing world, the motor vehicle, truck, diesel, service industry is growing very rapidly. It's forming and growing. You look in China, you look in, in India, places like that, it is just exploding. And as that grows, we're going to be there. We've already made that commitment. And it's going to be very common for students coming out of some of these programs in here to be working down the street here at a diesel operation or possibly around the world, especially when you start talking about the Slumbergers and the Cats and places like that. It's going to be very common for a new student coming out of some of these to get a job in, in China or a job in Africa or a job in South America, even in Antarctica. They, they have operations in Antarctica right now that are doing research and stuff that they need technicians. We're also in Antarctica. We ship tools down there all the time. Um, Anyway, our global mission statement requires that, we ha that, we, that our workforce is engaged with technology and embraces lifelong learning, and we realize that for us to be successful, that we need to support education around the globe, and that we are doing that. Snap-on firmly believes that we need to support and partner with education at all levels. It's a part of our culture, and it always has been. Snap-on has been involved with education for over 50 years. And a key to our business strategy is, is part of helping develop new qualified technicians that are going to work on, on this equipment, make sure they're, they're qualified, trained, up to date, also to make sure that that incumbent technician, his skills are brought up to the new technologies because the technicians that have been out there for a while, a lot of times their skills aren't quite there. We're committed to help that happen. The, then the last piece of that is to take those incumbent technicians and make sure they're helping mentor that new group of, of technicians coming in. There's a lot of knowledge that can be transferred and, and passed back and forth. We accomplish this with our partnerships with schools and other organizations, and we've been involved in those for a long time. For many years we've been involved uh, in organizations such as Skills USA, such as ACTE, NATEF, um, AES, for instance, World Skills on a global basis, and ATEC on the aviation side. And there's many, many more. We're involved in those. We help support those. We know that it's needed, and we're, we're going to continue to support those as we go along here. And all of this is important to us, Snap-on, because 
because these properly trained technicians are our future customers. They are our customers. And for the future of our company, we've got to make sure that they're successful. And if they're successful, then it's going to be successful for everybody. These customers um, are part of the community. They're part of the world. They're part of the country. It's important to that, that technician because that's what allows him, if he's properly trained and is making money, it's what allows him to make a living and it makes a difference for themselves, their families and their community. It's what allows them to, to survive and, and grow. And it's impart, important for business and industry as these properly trained technicians, uh, trained at educational facilities like this, this beautiful facility here at Francis Tuttle, there's other ones that are going to be popping up around the world. I know of one in Kenosha, Wisconsin that's going to come here pretty quick. It's those technicians that will keep the, the vehicles and the equipment running that are used for daily commerce, for security, for normal commutes, for, quite frankly, taking Billy to baseball. Um, it will keep those things running so they can succeed. Uh, and that will keep, keep a high quality of life for everybody as we go along all over the world and all over the globe. With that, Snap-on is very proud to be a part of this. Very, very proud to be part of education. Uh, we, we, we team up all over the country. And I want to thank Francis Tuttle and the team. I'm not going to name everybody. You're, you're the main guy. And uh, congratulations for this. We want to thank you very much. We're proud of you. I'm sure the community is. And thank you from Snap-on. With that, I'd like to introduce Frederick Brookhouse, who is the International Business Development Manager and it's, we talked about fearless innovation earlier. It's, it's fearless Frederick. <laughs> it's him and ideas of his that, that help us support things like this. So, Frederick? Thanks, First off, let me say that I, I travel with Brian a little bit. And the, it's a wonderful to travel with Brian. There's a, the downside is you, I always do have to speak after him. <laughs> but we're from Wisconsin. We have one question. Uh, you know, we had a long winter out there. What's that large orange ball in the sky? I've forgotten about what the sun is. See, we, we're talking about this building. I have to tell you, uh, Greg and I travel. We go to a lot of schools. Frankly, that's our job, is to work with the schools all across the United States, and I do some international work, too. Uh, it's hard to describe the level of the fantastic facility you have here. Uh, I, you know, I look out there and I think of the students. You know, they must really be excited to, to come into this building because I saw what happened at, at Gateway when Brian built his Horizon Center uh, recently and how the attitude changed. So I'm looking back there and thinking about those great students. And I think about the, that commitment from the people involved here at, at Francis Tuttle who I've, I've gotten to know over the years and I appreciate their commitment. You know, but, you know, part, and they've asked me to speak a little bit about the partnerships. And, it, you know, partnerships happen every day. You know, we make commitments to each other, to your wife, or your spouse, to your children. But 